Welcome and thank you so much for joining me today. So we are looking at um, area and perimeter of a, of a rectangle and thinking about it in terms of having an unknown. So let's read it and we need to break it, break it down. The outside perimeter is 18 meters. So that, that means perimeter is the outside. We're talking about this plus this plus this and plus this. So we're adding the fence of our rectangle. An eagle is 18. We would like to know what is the unknown length. So the first thing I'm going to be thinking about is this is width and this is length. If I'm using algebra, I'm just going to say we have two lots of L's, two lots of length, and I'm adding two of my width. I mean, I mean, answer yes, this in two ways. Now I know that it equals eighteen. We also know that our width is three. So um, I can say that we've got two times three for our width. Because three plus three. So two times three equals six. And then I know I want to take this away and work out what the total of these two are. So I know if I take 6 away from 18, because remember our spot, we take 6 from both sides. 18 take away 6 equals 12. And 6 take away 6 equals 0. So both of my lengths must equal 12. So if I've got both of these, I just need to divide it by 2. To get L by itself, so 12 divided by 2 equals 6. So the length equals 6 meters. I can double check that. 6 plus 6 equals 12. 12 plus 3 equals 15. 15 plus 3 equals 18. Another way I could have done it is non. This is 3 and this is 3. So width total is 3 plus 3 equals 6 then go on left over is 18 take 6 equals 12 and then half 12 to get 6 so this is doing it without algebra, this is doing it with algebra. And I still would have got the same answer of six meters. Likewise with area. When we're talking about area, we are talking about length multiplied by width. And that gives us our space in the middle. Here we know our space is 200 meters squared. We are wanting to find the unknown side. So this is unknown. So that just means I've, I know five times something must equal 200. Now, instead, what's the opposite of times by five? Divide by five. So if I divide this side by five, and this side by 5, I cancel this out using some algebra here. That gives us this side by itself. And now we've just got, if I've got 200 and I am dividing by 5, how much do I have? And the answer is 40. The way I worked that out in my head was 20 divided by 5 equals 4 out of 0 becomes 40. We can double check that, 40 times 5, 40, 80, 120, 160 and 200. So that just means that um, the length of the unknown side is 40 meters. Really hope that helps you understand um, how to find out the area, in particular when we've got an unknown side. If you need any extra help, message me and get back to me.